Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. I have nothing witty to say here. I'm exhausted. So I hope you're ready. Present me is tired. Other me from the past was super stoked to be on Manon. So I hope you're ready for the excitement and I will be with you in a moment. This is cool though. The music very much reminds me of um, a, a Zelda water temple. <gasps> I have Kiska! Ah, Jolie! Uh, and Kiska! I don't actually want to sell them, but I could! If he gave me a lot of money. I don't think they want to eat them. Why do you want to buy them? So you want to smuggle them in? <laughs> You're right, Coder 2 is bumpy. We, we want to give our Gizka to a good home. Yeah, I got some Gizka. Could persuade. Mm. Actually, I would really like to get rid of him. I know, right? One day I'll wake up. We won't have enough. We won't have enough to feed them, and they're gonna start eating us. I don't know, though. I don't want to like. I don't want to like give them an invasive species. You know. Uh, let's see. Let me try. Ooh. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. <gasps> you have you know a good hope for them, but you'll never tell me. I'll have to figure it out. All right, challenge accepted. I'm gonna figure it out. He the, the guy said go to the west central courtyard, so I'm not. This isn't the docking bay I came in. I'm in this docking bay. Let's go look what's in this docking bay. Froggies! We still have our froggy friends. What? Wait, what? Why were the cameras deactivated? We left the security zone? Oh, there's Sith, the Sith are here. Okay. A Sith soldier is an alien? The Sith don't accept aliens, ever. Very rarely. I'm trying to, okay. Enough time to listen to your stories. I've got a full shipment of Kalto ready to load before my shift is over. I think you're the raw, I think you, I don't think you're supposed to be a Twi'lek because you just spoke in common. I think you're supposed to be a human. 
Well, the original Sith were aliens, yes, but like, okay, I guess maybe not the Sith. You're right. I'm I'm conflating the Sith with the Empire. The Empire doesn't like aliens. The Sith probably don't care. I don't have time to listen to your stories. You're the same. I've got a full shipment of Kalto ready to load before my ship. You guys there. are the same. Hello there, Zaka. Welcome, welcome. He's a human in disguise. He was. This is creepy. Okay, I gotta go explore these other areas. Uh, this is the last area, and then I'll go to that courtyard. This music is so soothing. There's a ship in this one. Oh, look! See how it's all gray? That's because it, there's no security cameras activated in there. I think that's why. Uh. Oh, no, never mind. Well, yeah, Twi'leks, I mean, Twi'leks do in the Star Wars canon speak common if they want. In this game, I, the only Twi'lek I've met that speaks common is Mission. You played this game like 10 years ago? This is my first time playing it, actually. I've enjoyed it a lot, though. <laughs> Let me do it. On it. Damn. <gasps> it's in pot. Oh. That's lame. I feel like this is the end. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry. They, the others decided that they would have a no spoilers thing. A no spoilers command, but yeah, it's it's got. I've been getting assistance though, so that's no problem. No problem at all. I am playing this live, so you know there's a degree of there's going to be a degree of spoilers. And the game's like I don't know, 15 years old. All right, we're in the west courtyard. We're just gonna follow the training, the training droid, the cleaning droids. It's pretty old, yeah. Hi, fuzzy person. Who are you? I knew it. No, no. Ah, why, why, Stone Smith? Why do you yell? Game so old, you developed arthritis in your knees. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Getting old, man. <laughs> it sucks. It's okay. I actually like. Like, I know I'm not that old, but I do have a harder time of getting up, like, when I'm, like, kneeling down and, like, I don't know, like, like, brushing my dog. And then, like, like, it happened yesterday. I was brushing him. I tried to get up, and I was like, oh, my knees. My knees were not happy with me. Hello. Uh, that face just surprised you? That's one of the like standard aliens. I don't know what the rules are. Welcome to my world. Uh, please tell me the rules. Pathetic laws of pathetic fish don't concern me. Mwahaha. <laughs> Okay. I won't touch it. <laughs> we, re we react with violence if anybody tries to come 
compromise our neutrality. You know, I've actually been tempted to take, like, fish oil for my joints. Like, start now, and maybe my joints won't hate me when I'm old. You know what I mean? But fish oil, like, take fish oil pills, like, fish oil supplements, and, like, you smell like fish. Like, you really, really do. Like, your breath smells like fish the whole day, and you take them long enough, and you start to, like, sweat fishy smell. Like, so, I need to find a better, a better way. But, yes, especially with my job, I've... I took fish oil for a while because after a while walking like, you know, 10 to 15 miles a day is pretty hard on your joints. Imagine dating a cell kit. Already did. Thank you, though. <laughs> and then fish oil, right? Yeah. After a while, you just, you start, you, your breath smells like fish and you start sweating like a fish or you start sweating and it smells like fish. And then you just, you just, you just turn into a fish one day. You don't even, just wham, you're a fish. How can you be neutral when the Sith are trying to conquer everything? about it, the more fish oil sounds like a bad idea. If Thane was a fish... Yeah, I mean, I think in some circles he's called a fish man sometimes, but he's actually technically a lizard man. But he does look like a fish, too. So, yeah. Hee <laughs> hee hee. I love me, I love me, my lizard fish man. He's just the most handsomest, handsomest thing that's ever been, ever been created in fiction. Yeah, 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 yeah. You seem to have it all worked out. What? Why? Robbery. Fifty credits. No! I'm bad. I do like their design. Like, I like the, like, two-toned look they've got, where they, like, have, like, it looks like, it, you, know, you know the pattern that wa that sun and water make, like, when sun's shining through the water, and you see it at, like, the bottom of the pool or at the bottom of the ocean? That's the kind of the design they have, which is actually makes a lot of sense, because then if a predator is swimming above or below them, the idea is that hopefully they blend in with the reflections of the water, which indicates but they're not a deep sea species or even a middle mid-leveled sea species they're like they're very much like a coral sort of coastal like top layer oceanic species yeah no hanar no no i tried the jedi mind trick and i failed the Selkath are corporate buttheads they are my poor doggy are you so bored very well. Here's a doggy. You, yeah, map of the city. Worth it. All right, so we're never leaving Manon. Wait, what is the is the mind trick? 
Obi-Wan wouldn't have failed the mind trick. Why are you going to compare me to Obi-Wan? But now I have a map. So I can... S Never mind. I thought I was going to fill in the areas, but it didn't. Is the, is the Jedi mind trick something I actually have to acquire? It's not just... I don't just have it as a Jedi? That's something I gotta pick up? Obey the law, Whoa! Human. You turn very fast, very fast. I'm so excited for the water world! Water world, water world, water world. That was a good movie, by the way. You think it's a feat? <laughs> Grammy thinks it's a feat. <laughs> I just like the way it's like, Grammy, colon, thinks it's a feat. <laughs> That's what Kevin Costner said. I, I loved Waterworld. Okay, I loved Waterworld because when I was a kid, I wasn't supposed to watch it. But I'd hide upstairs in my grandparents' attic, which was basically like, you could go up these like st super dangerous like stairs. And it was like one of those like open, like only like top half, like like half of the upstairs was like a, like an attic-y type thing. It's an old cabin, super old cabin. And I'd watch Waterworld on this tiny like, I don't know, 10 by 10 TV. And I'd watch it all secret like upstairs where it was like super magical because my grandparents had all kinds of like weird, his face isn't rendering. He doesn't have eyes. Oh, there it goes. Um, but they had like all kinds of like cool little kitschy things upstairs that I thought looked really cool. Anyway, that's why I like Waterworld. Thanks! He's just standing there. Look how pretty it is! You enjoyed the film, but you also like a lot that you went to me too. <laughs> Is that one of those things? Oh, shoot. What did he say? He said, um, oh, God, that guy said, he said west, and then I think he said north. Did he say north? Colto Distribution Center. A Sith soldier. Where? Ooh, no, it's not west again. It's not west again. I got ripped off. That guy didn't actually give me a map, by the way. Where the It's a movie where the overacting of the bad guys is balanced by the underacting of Kevin Costner. I just thought it was so cool that, like, he was, like, mutated, and he could, like, swim and breathe underwater for long periods of time, and he'd go underwater, and he'd see, like, the ruins of our cities, and it was really cool, and then, like, and, and, the, and the bad guys were super spooky, and... And crazy, and they scared me very much. Uh oh, we gotta sh we gotta stand off here. We gotta stand off, boys and girls. Um, but I just like the idea that like everything that like I knew, like I don't know, like as a kid, I don't know if I really thought about it this way, but it was really in like it was just so interesting to me that things that like I took for granted every day were now these like underwater ruins, and like it was just crazy. It was just cool. Northwest. Northwest, west, northwest, north, south, east, west. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Your precious Republic's days are numbered. It won't be long until Malak turns his armada loose on Coruscant itself. Save your empty threats, Sith scum. Malak isn't stupid enough to attack the core worlds. Now with the entire Republic fleet waiting for him. You're a fool. When the Sith descend on Coruscant, our numbers will block out the sun itself. The galactic senators will collapse trembling in fear and beg for mercy at Malak's feet. You underestimate the Republic's resolve. We'll die before we surrender Coruscant. That can be arranged. Remember what happened to Taris. Malak could do the same to the core worlds. He wouldn't dare. Now it is you who underestimate our resolve. Oh boy, I like this though. It's something that I don't have to necessarily get involved in, but it's setting the stage for the like tense situation that's going on in Manon. You can trust me, I am your friend. <laughs> Sovereign confirmed, Reapers confirmed. It really, it really is. General store. I should have, oh, I should have gone to that distribution. I, I want to go back to the distribution center. Lorraine, you say that, you say that, you can trust me, I am your friend, you say it so, 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 so,
so scarily. <laughs> Alright, distribution center. Let's do this. Oh, Domino's, I already ordered you yesterday. Don't send me any more notifications. I'll die. Hello, 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 hello. Cell calf coordinator. Okay, okay. Oh, this is the distribution center of the coal corn. <laughs> I love that they're wearing like swap vests. You say that as though I'm not trustworthy. I heard your heart bleeds. I'm sure you'll be okay. <laughs> I just want to get some information. This is so fun! Star Wars is so fun! So cool! There's so many different aliens! And there's so many cool worlds to go explore! And there's a murder robot behind me. <laughs> Stella Smith, that's perfect. That's the emo for rain, for sure. I don't have a permit. Understandable. They're so strict. To be fair, I think most places IRL have something like that, where like you have to, like if I wanted to go work in Germany, I'd have to get like a, a work visa, you know. You need a hug. You need you need a hug, and your your heart pressed against a, your head. Your head pressed against a soft bosom. Here, 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 here you go. There you go. See, there you go. There's a there's a there's a hug, and and a soft bosom to lay your head upon. Right there. There you go. <laughs> Stop, man. You just made a... I don't have a hug email. Here, let me see. And then you create a monstrosity. <laughs> that was so soft you couldn't feel it. <laughs> Where can I get a purchase permit? Oh, okay. I may need that at some point. Export authority. Okay. Bye. So you already answered all my questions, so joke's on you. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, we've been to the distribution center. And I was going, I wasn't gonna go that way. No, 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 I wanted to go this way. Mostly we have to go west and north until the end somewhere there's a south and an east. <laughs> Four. <laughs> those hands though, they look like they're coming in really fast, like they're gonna strangle you. Uh, how long I'm playing? I know, I'm playing for a very long time. Uh, I may have to be done soon-ish before my dog has an actual breakdown of boredom. Okay, it's general store, general store. I could go buy some Colto, maybe. Look at those perfect hugs. How much for all this stuff, Tybark? Thanks, Tybark. Catch you next week. Okay, okay. So this guy's a Republic sympathizer. Alright, alright, alright. We can work with that. We are Republic. Now I gotta get back to my post at the Republic Embassy. My break is almost over. Oh, okay. We had a cutscene for that. This is fine. 
agi inko tune chuna mori ra tangi wama jiko na tong ipa nonku nek abob just kronki to pets nemo chi ita kanki chana kiri kon inba muri ra wana ji inba nonku nikset abob achua penki yun patisa di chuba ji kuta naga kingu mwa muri ra dwana inba nik chaloda kun Oh, that Zerka course will. Advanced med pack. Uh, sure, I'll buy one more advanced med pack. Military suit. Blah blah blah. Blah 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 blah. Blah blah blah. Both a needler. That's cool. Got Canaan. Zabrak Basil Cannon? What the frick? Pistol targeting optics. Ow, oh, I just popped my neck. Combat sensor. Nothing can be used by Wookiee. That's a bummer. Dexterity plus two, but it gives you. It's for the blaster pistol. Which I don't. <gasps> What's this? Oh, it's so expensive, but wow, that's so terrifying. But it makes me immune to all mind effects. Uses microbursts of electricity to regulate the user's mental patterns. Wow, that's cool. I could save up for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Advanced oral amplifiers. Oh, wait, no, no. Ooh. It's protecting against a variety of gas-based attacks. Is that worth it, do you think? The breath mask? Yeah, the stabilizer mask is pretty awesome. That seems like it would be really nice. Neural band. Will. <laughs> Awareness. <laughs> Fortitude. Blip. Reflex. Blip. Constitution. It's expensive! Mm, single use. Advanced stun ray. Oh, that's expensive. That'd be nice. That would be nice. Branson, hello! How's it going? Welcome to my first time playing coder and shopping. I love shop. Not my first time shopping. First time playing coder. But I found some real sweet things here. If only I could use my persuade powers to make things cheaper. Oh well. What? Assistant droid. Okay. Hi, Sith soldiers. Don't mind me. What are we? Well, that would be Norris. That's probably that's probably where I have to go. Random door. But there's so many doors. Shady Rodian. What? You missed this game? I've enjoyed it. This is. My first time playing it, and it's we just got to this planet, but I'm really enjoying it. It's very cool. I, I like water planets. Let me talk to the Shady Rodian. Con muli slimo poi wanga kun viskin. Tu mirana nu prata donko sercha doman toma kaba vorpa murji guma ya. Why are you just standing here in a corner? La boda na winki smak toma. Jis kada soki kupa bona na chachu. I don't want to play that game ever. This is your first RPG in 2003? It seems like a good one to have. All right, we won't go that way. We'll go north. 
No, because this was just like a random door, so I feel like it's gonna be a dead end. Aha! East Courtyard! No, 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 I don't want to go east yet. I'm pretty sure. I guess, I don't know, I, I am currently playing my, like, a Star Wars D&D campaign. And the other day I tried to call the Twi'leks Tiamats. I was like, why? Why did I do that? So, so I was like, okay, it's time to play Coder. And we're gonna cut it off there. So thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next one.